up around the side of the house that I am really excited about. So this is something that we've been wanting to do ever since we, before we bought a house, I've been wanting to do this. Good morning, guys. So it is another beautiful day outside. I'm actually heading downstairs to see what Miles is up to and see if he wants to head outside and do some work in the yard with me. I actually I can probably turn off my air conditioning. I don't think I'll be in my office for the rest of the day. But um, yeah, probably gonna try and head outside and plant some of those um, plants that my mother-in-law has given me over the last couple of days. There's like those two lilies that I was talking about that I think I'm gonna put in the um, like planters on our porch. And then I also got that new Black Eyed Susan which is going in the garden bed. I just have to find a spot for it. But, you know, let's see. Are you down here? Are you in the bathroom? What are you doing? I'm trying to see if I actually, like, I cooked myself with a crab last night. I don't know. And it, like, hurts and it's really red. And it looked like I kind of had, like, like, a splinter or something. I don't know. And I squeezed it and, like, stuff came out. <laughs> Yum. <laughs> but I think it just is irritated. I'm sorry. So now I'm gonna pour the stuff on it. All right. Well, <laughs> you wanna go outside with me? Uh, yeah, I'm gonna eat a little lunch. Whoops, did I get you? No, you're good. Uh, all right, sounds good. All right, so it's a little later and we've been working out in the yard. We have gotten so much accomplished. So first, I planted these lilies in the pots. Like, these pots aren't my favorite, but they came with our house and they've just been sitting on our pet or our porch um, empty, basically, since we moved in and whatever was in them died. But yeah, these are the pretty lilies that I got from my mother-in-law the other day. Unfortunately, two of the blooms fell off during the... Um, transplanting process but hopefully we should get some more there's definitely a ton of buds on here so yeah that'll be nice and pretty I'm gonna move these out to the porch as soon as I finish filming this and then I also got some help with um, planting this guy from the girl next door so she's four and she came over and was helping me plant it and was super helpful it was really really cute and she picked the spot for it so that's where it went <laughs> and these are black eyed Susans these are the guys that I got from um, again my mother-in-law but these I brought home last night from crabs and yeah hoping that will grow nice and strong kind of right now the tactic I'm taking with this garden is I'm not planning it out too much because I know I'm not gonna like a have the money to fill up this entire garden like this summer so I'm kind of just like planting whatever I have and you know hoping that it grows and you know as much as it can and I can always kind of move things around and make an actual plan with it um next summer so I don't really care where things go currently as long as they're you know planted and happy and alive so yeah and you can kind of see the mulch that uh, Miles laid down yesterday and here's how the rest of the garden is looking and then we actually just finished a project up around the side of the house that I am really excited about so this is something that we've been wanting to do ever since we before we bought a house I've been wanting to do this so we installed the arch that we actually got married under next to the house and I think it looks so cute it's like going from the front into the backyard and um, yeah we've been wanting to do this since like before we even bought a house ever since we got the arch for the wedding I was like oh my gosh this would be so cute to kind of keep and then put up whenever we bought a house and so we finally got that done today and I'm super excited thank you for your help and yeah I think that's just like so stinking adorable and I love it so now we are done with all the stuff that we're gonna do outside for the day and I think we are going to um, head on out and do grocery shopping for the week all right so we stopped by Starbucks before going to the grocery store I got an everything croissant like everything bagel seasoning on a croissant and honestly I was underwhelmed I did not think it was you know as groundbreaking as I thought it was gonna be sorry the lighting's weird also, also by the way like it's extreme sun right now so I feel like our faces are like totally blacked out but anyways um, I also got an iced hazelnut latte venti and again kind of underwhelmed I don't know if they like made it weird or if I just don't remember this is what like lattes taste like because I've been doing like frappuccinos for so long but like I don't know, it's just not the best. Or I, maybe I like should have gotten caramel instead. I think you should have gotten caramel. I think I, I should have gotten caramel. We used to sweet. Yeah, so I'm a little upset about that, but oh well, what can you do? <laughs> but what'd you get? I don't know, I can't remember what it's called. All right, well. Something with coconut milk and coffee. And... How is it? Wonderful. Wonderful. <laughs> All right, well, now we are heading to the grocery store. Where do we decide we're going? Are we going to Trader Joe's? I don't know. Are we going to Trader Joe's? I don't know. 
All right, yes, we're going to Trader Joe's. <laughs> All right, so we just left Trader Joe's and we did our shopping for the week. We were very on point with our grocery shopping, by the way. We only bought like what we needed. We didn't like overbuy too much, which we sometimes struggle with. <laughs> and I got a new snack, so I'm giving Trader Joe's a second chance. So yeah, I got another snack that I'm probably gonna fall in love with and I'm just gonna discontinue it again, but you know, you live once, so. <laughs> They are the Sweet Plantain Chips, and they look like that. And I've obviously never had them before, so let's see how they taste. They're pretty good. Yeah? Yeah. I mean, definitely not up to like honey butter chip standard, but they're good. Yeah. yeah. Crunchy. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I'd say it's a win. So tonight for dinner, we're five years old. <laughs> We got chicken tenders because Miles felt like chicken nuggets, but well, these are, I don't know, these are like big chicken nuggets. They're not quite chicken tenders, right? Chicken tenders. They're chicken tenders. I feel like chicken tenders are more like long usually and like different. I feel like these are just like chunky nuggets. <laughs> but yeah, anyways, we were having chicken whatevers. Nuggets are made with ground chicken. These are just breaded chicken breasts. Oh, are they? Okay. So they're chicken, they're tenders. Okay, gotcha. All right, well, we are having chicken tenders, and then we have some ketchup and our cute little sauce dipping bowls, and then I am having, what are they, just garlic french fries? Was that the sauce? Okay, yeah, so garlic french fries, and then Miles is having some tater tots. How are your tots? Good. Good. <laughs> and we're gonna watch Handmaid's Tale. All right, guys, we're winding down over here. Cute little feet. Hello. Cute little husband. Cute little puppy. Where are you going? Someone got sick again after dinner tonight. But it wasn't like as bad as it was last night. So I think she just has a bug. Yeah. Or Cause she's acting like completely normal. Like she's not even acting like she doesn't feel well. Even like around when she gets sick, she's just like completely normal. So I don't know, I'm not too worried anymore. Especially cause she, she ate breakfast fine. And like yeah. kept that down and like like I'm saying, she like has like all her energy. She like is acting completely fine. So I don't know what's wrong with you, but I don't think it's anything concerning. Yeah, I don't either. <laughs> yeah. Um, watched the most recent Handmaid's Tale, which was awesome. It's just such a sad show. It is. <sighs> it kind of breaks my heart. <laughs> but now we're going to bed. Miles actually like is working from home for the next two days. So I feel like it's just been such a weird like. You had two days off last week, you had the weekend, now you have two days that you're working from home this week. Like, I feel like we haven't had, like, a normal, like, our normal schedule in, like, so long. Yeah. I'm just so thrown off. <laughs> but, yeah, so we're still gonna head to bed because it's still, you know, work night because he still has to get up and work even though it's from home. But, yeah, how was your weekend? You have a good, good one? Good. All right, well, then I think I guess I'm just gonna wrap things up. So, yeah, <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed the vlog. Give it a thumbs up if you did. Don't forget to subscribe down below if you haven't already, and we'll see you guys tomorrow. Good night. Mm -hmm.